how to use cash book entry in SQL. Hi everyone, it's Jason here from EIST SQL. In today's video, I'm going to explain what other functions are in included inside the cash book entry button. Okay, so when you press the cash book entry button, it will redirect you to a cash book entry. Okay, basically here, we were having two different functions, which is on the right hand side, new PV and also new OR. One is payment voucher, another one is official receipt. Okay, so let's say for example, you are buying stationery, let's say from popular, all you have to do is just key in what are the payment you are made towards. Okay, let's say it's to popular. Okay, so underneath the GR account code, you need to specify what is the account code you want to record this transaction as. Let's say is stationary. Okay, then you need to specify the total amount you paid to this uh, particular uh, company. Let's say is 800 ringgit worth of stationary. Okay, so this is how you can record a basic transaction that are not related to your trading items. Okay, so the next thing we will go to next new OR. Okay, for example, let's say your director decided to do a fund in into the company, then you can do a transaction under the receipt voucher. Okay, then over here the receipt from you can specify which director you receive this money from. Let's say I just directly key in as director. Okay, so underneath the GL account code, then you need to specify which account you are recording these particular funds to. Okay, then after you need to specify the total amount you receive from your director. Okay, let's say it's 8,000 ringgit. Okay, after you press the enter, you can save this document as your official receipt. Okay, that's all for today's video. If you are liking this video, please make sure to like and also subscribe to help us to support our channel and to watch more content like this. Alright, thank you.